Shalom, everyone. So this is another segment of things that I want to do. I said every now and then I want to talk about breaking news or breaking issues that pop up. And I had this segment that I'm just going to call breaking news. <laughs> I mean, why not? I'm trying to make it funny and light and entertaining. Um, first thing I'm going to deal with doing this, this, this is my first uh, segment of breaking news. Well, officially, y'all might have seen this before. If you've seen any of my earlier videos, y'all seen me use the breaking news thing before. But I said it's nice to come out and bring it now, especially dealing with issues like this. All week long, I've been saying about Chris uh, Rock and the situation with Chris Rock. And it's like everybody's talking about him and he's finally spoken out ever since the slap and then they turn around and say oh uh now they turn around and say will smith is finally speaking out will smith got something to say and they're going back and forth between chris rock and will smith and i'm just like okay i made this video um uh last year right after the slap made this video where i found the clip that showed that something like this happened before. Um, so I said, okay, either this is a Simpson moment, you know, the Simpsons normally predict stuff, and everybody said, oh, the Simpsons did it again. The Simpsons did it again, right? So this is something like the Wayans brothers, right? The Wayans brothers actually did a skit at an award show. And the skit that they did at the award show, it really resembles what happened at this award show with the real Chris Rock. In this skit, you had Sean Wayans, and Sean was pretending to be Chris Rock. And you see Will Smith sitting in the audience laughing like he did at the Oscars. You see Will sitting there laughing and Chris Rock is up there cracking his jokes. And then something peculiar happens. A guy walks up on the stage and with the same hand Will Smith smacked the real Chris Rock with last year. This guy, and I believe this clip is from 2000. Um, this guy actually slaps Chris Rock the same exact way. All right, so I actually put this scene in right here from Oprah. Here you go, Oprah talking to Dr. Oz, and it's from something where she's talking about something being not being a coincidence and how it can't be a coincidence. It's too much for it to be a coincidence. And as she makes that, it, it just was so fitting with the video because it was talking for me. Um, where, you know, she was basically saying this can't be a coincidence. So I, I set the video off first with this on my channel. The video is actually called This Is Not A Coincidence. So I'm going to go ahead and start it and go from there. Why? I don't believe in coincidence. I know you don't, which no. is why I want you to explain this to everybody. Again. Oops, she did it again. She did it again. All right, so here I go right here. I'm at the show like everybody else. I'm enjoying the show. Everybody else is enjoying the show. Um, yeah, so I'm enjoying the show like everybody else. <laughs> and I want you to notice up now, Chris Rock. Sean is imitating Chris Rock in this scene. What Sean is doing in this scene is he's imitating Chris Rock. Sean is saying getting on Britney Spears said oops she did it again she did it again y'all what the f she do in the first place right being real disrespectful to Britney Spears and you see Britney Spears really is not feeling this even though she knows that this is Sean pretending to be Chris Rock but she's really not feeling this just Aww. like Jada really wasn't feeling it right and it's going to flash to a familiar face laughing in the background. Yeah, who's that? 
Who's that laughing? I, love, I want you to see this now. I want you to clearly see this. Hey, go Chris Rock. She's upset and he's laughing. <laughs> Let's go back. Let's go back. He's laughing. This is Will. This this is this is an old, old thing, right? This is Will laughing. He's like, ha ha, he he he. He's having a good old laugh. And it's just funny, right? Funny. And <laughs> And as he's laughing and, and and having a good time, I purposely went to the modern clip of what happened last year to show you that the exact same thing happened. We're going to see just like Britney Spears was annoyed and then it flashed to Will Smith laughing. You want to see Jada annoyed and then it's going to flash to Will laughing. That was a nice one. Okay. That's now, you see how it went? It was the exact same thing, right? And then I was trying to get people to see what I was so, what I was saying because I'm using the Oprah clip. I'm going back and forth. So I put the Oprah clip in, but Oprah is now going to say, that's not a coincidence. It's in the script. That's in the script. It's in the script. Now, is he up there still ragging on people? Talk about got Eve here, my bad, that's Cisco. And he's sitting there just ragging on people going on and on and on. It was the same way Chris Rock. Remember Chris Rock said, ha, ha, that was a light one. Ha, 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 ha. And try to laugh it off, right? So we see the same scenario happen. Now watch what take place. Watch this though. <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh, no, puppy. I'm out here. Now, we see somebody at the court of that is supposed to be Puffy, right? And he'll say, Oh, no, Puffy. Even before he hit him, he say, Oh, no. Like he see it coming. Oh, no. Look at what's about to happen to me. Oh, no. Look at, look at what's about to take place, right? So he says, Oh, no, Puffy. And then Puffy smacks him, right? So look at what's going to happen. Watch this. Watch this. He's going to walk straight up with a bop. Watch. Smack him. Uh -oh. See? Same thing. Want you guys to see the same thing. Now he says, uh-oh, Richard. This is how he said, oh, no, Puffy. Never here. He said, oh, uh-oh, Richard. Right? He didn't say Will Smith. He said Richard because, of course, he played, you know, he played Venus and Serena Father. So he trying to make a connection with that in the movie. So he says, uh-oh, Richard. Right? Now, watch this. Now, I really want you guys to see this because for some reason, people kind of overlooked this and did not pay this no attention. I really want you to see this. What are the chances of that happening? No. That is not a coincidence. No. She says that is not a coincidence. Right? She make it clear. We see clearly right here what happens. The guy walks up, just like how Will Smith was going to walk up, and smacks this fit skit. So either the Marlin brothers was able to predict what was going to happen 22 years later or this was a sham a big laugh in your face like literally and everybody is still falling for it which is really upsetting i'm like is everybody still falling for this i know people say come on man you're a conspiracy theorist what are you talking about i'm just pointing out the facts is this not an old video with Sean Wayans imitating Chris Rock? It is not Will Smith laughing at him joning on Britney Spears. Did not Chris Rock get smacked with the right hand 
a power just like he did in on the real Chris Rock did by Will Smith. So it's very, very similar. So either they predicted it or it was planned. It's up to you. I'm, I'm gonna leave that to you. But I'm just saying it is all kind of weird to me that this got a buzz for the Oscars. Now people buzz is a buzz for the Oscars. Everybody remember the Oscars. Everybody gonna look at the Oscars. See if something else gonna happen. Now it, 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 it builds a buzz for people to, to look at it because, hey, this show kind of exciting. People getting smacked on it. We don't know what's going to happen. And two of the biggest people get into it and we see they still heated about it because now the weekend of the Oscars, they now got the buzz about it all over again because people are arguing about it. Everybody that made content for it the whole week. I'm making this content for it just to say it's questionable. Either the Wham brothers predicted what happened or you fill in the blanks. Either Wham, either the Wham brothers predicted was what happened or you fill in the blanks, right? Because at this point it is what it is. So again, you know, you see clearly through the clips what happens. And I'm gonna just let this last part play out again so y'all can just see it for yourself. And you can say, wow, he, he got a point. We got Eve here. Oh, my bad. That's Cisco. <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh, no, puppy. I'm out here. Uh oh, Richard. <laughs> oh, wow. That is not a coincidence. What are the chances of that happening? No. That is not a coincidence. No. I agree. I agree, Oprah. That is not a coincidence. It's not a coincidence. It's not a coincidence. Like, it's not. Like, come on now. Like, what, what, are, we, what are we really saying? Because I'm just saying, don't believe the hype. As, as Flavor and I would say, don't believe the hype was a sequel. All right? Don't believe the hype was a sequel. Remember that. Don't believe the hype was a sequel. All right, just let's just keep that let's just keep that in mind. Um as we look at these situations because I'm still sitting here like this can't be true. Like I hear you, it sounds good, but at the end of the day, can I really believe this? Or these guys were psychics. You know? I don't know. You tell me. Leave something in a, in, a, in a chat about it and let me know what you think. But I thank you guys again, and I will see you guys on the flip side of the show. And as always, have a blessed one. Cheers.